There are a bunch of restaurants serving Uruguay wine in Uruguay, and we're going to be checking out a couple to find out what they're serving and the Uruguayan wines that are being served with that food. Sophie, you are born in France and then you grew up in Chile and now you own a wine restaurant in Montevideo. I mean, what brought you to Uruguay? I felt home beside the sunset, the countryside, the people and the warm welcoming is what I love the most about Uruguay. So you have served us already. Tell me about what, what Uruguayan wine we've got. We, I serve you at Sanat. It's the emblematic grape here in Uruguay. The youngest winemakers are starting to make tanat more, more less oak, easiest, easiest to drink. This tanat is in between. It has a little bit of oak, but you can feel that it's a younger tanat. Mm. Mm. It's delicious. So Sophie, what did you choose for us? Ribeye with pepper sauce. Oh, look at that. Wow. So you get my seal so, of approval. Yeah. Here. One thing that I really like about Baco is that they have a really brilliant way of choosing the 150 labels of which half are Uruguayan? Yeah, we try to have at least half of Uruguayan wines. It's our selling point. How we choose it, I have to try it all. I don't have a wine here that I haven't tried. Not a bad job. Usually it's my husband, who is the owner as well, and myself. Then we have a winemaker and one person who likes wine, doesn't know much about the technique part, but will tell me I like it or I don't like it. With no I explanation. Our wine list is the order by grape and then in each grape is by order of intensity. That is really brilliant, actually. If you like stronger wine, you're going to choose the first one. If you want lighter one, you're going to choose the bottom one. <gasps> what is coming? Okay, so I need to confess that I do not like sweet things. It's a very weird thing. I only know two other people in the world that don't like sweet things. So I really love it when I come to Baco that I get to eat cheese like in a typical European dessert. And here you have Morbier, the new way, Roquefort from France, Camembert made in Uruguay, and Brie made in Uruguay as well. What are we getting with we're, the wine? We're going to Sophie. pair it with Merlot. Merlot is a very elegant and versatile grape. It's it's not as known as the Tanat. The Uruguayan Merlot that you can try is very good. I can't wait to dive in. Cheers. 